I'd like to welcome all of you to this wonderful Sunday, this wonderful Sunday where we have rain falling from the sky, knowing that we will have flowers that bloom later. And we always know that in order to have such great joys, maybe there has to be a little bit of a moment of sadness somewhere along the way. And that is proven here today because we are celebrating with great joy the retirement of our longtime friend Brian and Kathy. But at the same time, we celebrate that joy. We are also tinged with a little bit of sadness. So, want to be thankful for them as we go through this service. And I'm sure before we're finished, they'll know how much we do love them. Let us pray. Dear Lord, we give you thanks for this very special day in the life of our church. We lift up our hearts in gratitude for the gifts that you bestowed on our beloved friends, Kathy and Brian, and for their, their desire to share those gifts with us. We have all been greatly enriched by that friendship. We are also grateful that we are not saying goodbye, but only changing the way in which we will interact. We look forward to having them sit among us and continue our long friendship. But today we celebrate the journey we have shared and will continue to share. We ask for your blessings for Kathy and Brian as they move to their own new green pastures. These things we pray for in the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. Now please join me responsibly in our call to worship. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not walk. He makes me my bed on the green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He restores my soul. He leads me in right path for his name's sake. Even though I walk through the darkest valley, I fear no evil, for you are with me. Your God and your staff take comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil, my cup overflows. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I shall dwell in the house of the Lord my whole life long. Now please join us in our opening hymn, hymn, The King of Love My Shepherd Is. Please stand and sing verses 1 and 2 from page 8 in the bullet.
And now please join me in our prayer of confession. Gentle Shepherd, you guide us in right paths. You lead us in the ways of righteousness, but we have allowed our anger, our rage, our greed, and at times even hate, to direct our paths. We have overreacted. We have taken more than our share. We have despised others that seem to have it all. Forgive us, God, for not following your ways. Forgive us for not remembering that we are your sheep and you are our shepherd. Forgive us when we have not listened for your voice and instead have acted in the ways of the world. Guide us back to your path through loving you and loving our neighbors. Help us to one clench our fists and lend out our hands in hope and healing, forgiveness and love. In the name of Christ our Shepherd, we would pray. Amen. And now a moment for silent confession. Jesus is the stone that was rejected by you. The builders, it has become the cornerstone. There is salvation in no one else, for there is no other name under heaven given among mortals by which we must be saved.